It was a crisp autumn morning, and the city was painted in hues of orange and gold. As I stepped into my luxurious office, a wave of excitement rushed through me. Today, as the CEO of a successful multinational company, I had an important meeting with potential investors. However, little did I know that this day would mark the beginning of a beautiful love story. As I settled into my lavish office chair, I couldn't help but notice a new face among the employees. He was a young man, impeccably dressed in a crisp white shirt and a well-tailored suit. His name was Alex, and he had just joined as a tea boy to serve beverages to the office staff. There was something captivating about him, his warm smile, his sparkling eyes, and the aura of humility that surrounded him. Intrigued, I decided to strike up a conversation. I asked him about his interests and dreams, and to my surprise, he shared his passion for writing. Alex had always dreamt of becoming a novelist, and the way he spoke about his dreams ignited a spark within me. Over the next few weeks, I found myself seeking every opportunity to interact with Alex. We would share little snippets of our lives during tea breaks, and I discovered that we had many things in common. Despite our different backgrounds, our souls seemed to connect effortlessly. One afternoon, while sipping tea in the office balcony, I couldn't resist asking him about his writing. To my delight, he shyly shared a small excerpt from one of his stories. His words were poetic, and his imagination seemed to know no bounds. I was mesmerized, and right then, I knew that I wanted to be a part of his journey towards becoming a successful writer. As our friendship blossomed, my admiration for Alex grew. He was hardworking, passionate, and had an undeniable charm. He had this remarkable ability to find beauty in the simplest of things, which was a stark contrast to the fast-paced world I was accustomed to. He taught me to slow down and appreciate the small joys in life, like the first sip of tea in the morning or the feeling of autumn leaves beneath our feet. One evening, as the office lights dimmed and the city lights adorned the horizon, I asked Alex to accompany me to a charity gala. He was hesitant, feeling out of place among the elite attendees, but I assured him that he deserved to experience the grandeur. The night was magical, and I could see the wonder in his eyes as he observed the opulence around him. We danced under the shimmering chandeliers, and as we swayed to the music, I felt a rush of emotions inside me. It was as if the symphony of love had enveloped us, and we were both caught in its spell. In the weeks that followed, we found ourselves falling in love. It was an enchanting tale of two souls entwined, each bringing out the best in the other. The world seemed brighter, and my heart felt full of warmth and tenderness. However, our love story faced its share of challenges. Society disapproved of our unconventional relationship, and rumors began to circulate within the office. But we stood strong, for we knew that our love was genuine and worth fighting for. As time passed, Alex's writing career flourished, and his first novel gained critical acclaim. It was a proud moment for both of us, as I had been a part of his journey from the beginning. Our love for tea became a symbol of our love for each other, and we would often spend lazy afternoons sipping tea and discussing our dreams and aspirations. We realized that love was not about societal norms or material wealth, it was about finding someone who completes you in every sense of the word. In the end, our love story prevailed, and we decided to embark on a new journey together. Hand in hand, we walked towards a future filled with love, adventure, and the sweet aroma of tea, forever cherishing the symphony of love that brought us together. Thank you for listening. Subscribe our channel.